From my window, I can see a castle with three chimneys. I can even hold it in my hand. The natural resources that we've been blessed with, and in particular coal, has been today and has in the past couple of decades been an important fabric not only directly for the Navajo Nation, but regionally for the entire state of Arizona. You need to be a warrior with armor to get in the castle. Having such a good job so close to home um, makes a huge difference. Papa says it's the heart of the land. Sometimes I think I can hear it beating. That generating plant flows the Colorado River water down into the valley in the Phoenix region all the way into Tucson. That heart's been beating for a long time, maybe longer than mine. To me, I feel like it's something I have to give back to my community. following in my grandparents and my father's footsteps while working here. Many of the policymakers nationally that are pushing for increased regulations on uh, carbon and increased regulations on a coal economy really don't understand many of the families on the Navajo Nation. I think it'll live to be 120. And a uh, lot of people don't understand what power plant, the way it works and how it works. What smoke are you talking about? That's not smoke, this is steam. Water, hot water being cooled down. If you don't understand the power plant, ask before you start accusing. Why are they doing it? All it can do is cause damage to our economy, to uh, the livelihood, of the Navajo, the Hopi, they need to correct this situation. Just the three years of working really helped me and benefit me a lot. So it'd be nice to at least have 10 more years out of it. <laughs> yeah.